High School will have a new baseball coach after the district chose to part ways with the current coach and not all parents are happy. Chancellor Wynn joins us live at the high school with more about the decision and the reaction to it. <laughs> Yeah, Rob, as you can see behind me, we are live here at William Henry Harrison High School. And Harrison is having a school board meeting tonight w discussing one of the matters, which is the decision to not renew the contract of the baseball coach. Now, at this meeting, many parents and other residents of Harrison standing up, both speaking out in favor of the decision and some in opposition. I want you to take a listen and get an inside look at tonight's meeting. There's never been a problem in the past, but this year, the parent complaints grew louder. Many supporters of baseball coach Sean Souders believe that his contract is not being renewed because of complaints made to the Southwest local school district. But some who are in favor of the district's decision believe it was time for the program to move in a new direction because of allegations about how Souders treats players. Calling a boy in their formative years fat asses and piss ants does not reflect trust, respect, ownership, and leadership. Others have heard allegations about reasons some players were cut from the team over the years. I've had a number of students who have told me that they were told if they didn't play for his summer league, that they would have a tough time making the high school team. And I don't care how good a coach you are, if that is done, if that is said, you should be dismissed. But one mother says that allegation is not true because her son did not play in the summer league and still made the team. Is he tough? Absolutely. My son would come in and say, yep, he's tough, but you know what? I need to man up. I got to earn my spot. The board says the decision to not renew Souders contract is final and one parent supporting the decision of the board says it's time to look ahead. The kids are moving forward and the adults need to follow their lead. Let's rise above the attacks and show support for all student athletes. Now, the school board says that every contract that a coach has, when it expires, they have the ability to decide not to pick up that contract. And they say their decision is final for the baseball team. And so the baseball team will be seeing a new head coach heading into this season. Reporting live in Harrison, Chancellor Wynn, Fox 19 Now. Chancellor, thank you very much.